gonna go save them. Both Aerith and Marley. How could this happen? I didn't really what think so. Oh, we gotta keep moving. The people upstairs you think he's okay? had it worst. Because that's 100% of people from the upstairs are dead. Some on the, wasn't on the bottom. Was it? How would I know? Some on the bottom could survive, but upstairs people, they just dropped to hell. house it's in the sector five slums and that's where Marlene is I don't where know hope she is tell me she is give me something to hang on to even if she's not I won't blame you for it I swear she's there okay who am I kidding I'd probably try to tear your head off Tifa, know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. Talk to the flowers. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. <laughs> Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> you have failed again, I see. nothing let's go this guy what the fuck Barrett Jesus Christ Jokobos are so frightened they're refusing to move the chocobos be my quick travel? Wait. Over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Mm. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Follow you, Barrett. Hey. Did you find what you were looking for? Thanks to you, I did. Good. Now never let it go again. I need to prep for my next show. Even with this? Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. However, did it come to this? Give me a second. The first thing we need to do is find a place. I'm sure I went by Chocobo Sam. It's bedlam. Yeah, I knew it. 
Hey, pretty crazy, huh? Can you believe this mess? You doing all right? I am, but I can't say the same about my birds. Poor things are scared half to death. Gotta calm them down somehow. Okay. There's a hole in the sky. We have somewhere else to be right now. But can I still go to the... No, okay. You have to do the main scenario first. We're searching the compound as we speak, sir. She got it, Barrett. Let's go see Marlene first. You guys run into Jesse at the pillar? Yeah. Biggs, too. They Let were both in pretty Let bad shape. But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Oh. You got it. Later on, if if the game allows me to, I would like to go find Biggs, Wedge, and Jesse. Man, Elmira is gonna be so pissed. Are still ringing. Sector 5. This is Sector 5, right? So, where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm He's going up. as fast as you are. Did a play really fall? This one's for Aerith. This one's for Cloud. World's just too dangerous these days not to keep away. Chatley around? Hey, the kid. Cloud, I'm glad to see that you're okay. In these trying times, I hope to develop new materia to help us endure. Have you got a new battle for me? Oh, there it is. Oh, no, wait, that's not it. ATB stagger, small ATB boost on staggered foe. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Okay. Um, while analyzing the stagger effect, I verified the existence of a peculiar behavior that uh, presumed to be an acute response to stress. 
have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new material. Enemy skill. I look forward to receiving all of your. Okay. Chakra. Uh. Tifa's gonna get enemy skill. I still don't know how to break beyond 160% though. Kids. Wait, don't scare the poor lady that stays there. Where's Marlene? Is she here? Barrett. Don't scare the poor woman that lives in this house, Barrett. Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Marlene, she's got short hair. She's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a She's pink dress today. She's sleeping Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. Uh. I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Okay. Keep it down. Don't wake her. I don't know, man. Hey. <sighs> you okay? should join your friend upstairs. Look. Keep it down. Don't wake her. I I'm, I'm just, I'll try. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. I don't think it's saying anything. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that? Saying that, but... She must trust on. you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. Neither is Marlene to Barrett, if you in case you can tell. Ago, my husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went, to wait and to pray. I 
And that's how I met her. Her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market. Or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. What's Aerith's mom's name again? Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. It's, it's an adult hit on a little girl's body. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. <sighs> I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean... What can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. Oh, this one. And then she gets the note that her husband's died. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Ugh, that's so rough. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. Coming! Man, he did not age. No! Go away! Aaron. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <sighs> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! And then she runs up the stairs, <laughs> originally Aerith, like a little, little even when shit. you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home. Once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, I don't know if I could... If I could ever... Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. 
Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Let's? Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Please take care of Marlene. Take care of yourselves now. You too, Almira. Take care of yourselves now. You too. Favorite flowers. All right. Sector seven is nine hundred. Sector seven is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? I know a way. Passage in the park. Ah, uh, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know Walk. another way to get there. Aerith showed me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows her stuff. Didn't mean anything by it. Well then, this is um, this is a this is a tough time. Got uh, it's tough time, tough time for everyone. My ears are still ringing from it. This, wasn't... this kind of thing isn't supposed to happen. Look, the p oh god, over there. Look up. Just an entire plate gone. Tough. Alright, we're going in here. Let me get some closure on the three avalanche guys. And add to the rubble of this place. I don't think this music is befitting of this bit. Ain't no walking away from this! So you better hold it! It's out there, God! Bring it home! Barrett! Good job. Whatever, man. Let's go. At least you don't have to fondle the hand anymore. It's blocked. Duh. There, that way. We'll have to fight our way through. But it's our only shot. Alrighty, new path. I'll tell you one thing, gameplay-wise, I can't, I can't wait to actually um, 
go back to War Market and uh, and do that do that uh, Corneo Cup thing. This won't take long. These are different. Ice. Have they been upgrading my weapons for me? They have. Holy shit, the Buster Sword's just 59 attack now. Oh, but Harley just got... Oh. McCloud's got a fair amount of magic though. And Buster Sword's got four slots. They both lead the same way. Go in the tunnel. It's on now. It's on now. Oh, come on. Enemy skill can be learned from this monster. Tifa, wait! Hey! I thought I gave her enemy skill. Or is that not how... I might be thinking of uh, the FF8 version where you, where you eat, not eat, where you use the um, use an item, or you can just like absorb it from them. But I guess you have to get hit by it. All right. Well, let's drag it out. Ditto. Let's have a look at the enemy skill material, shall we? Gives you a chance of the enemy techniques that you've endured and used them as abilities. Okay. So Tifa has to eat one of those moves. Maybe I could give it to Cloud and Cloud can take the move. Sweepers. Sweeper and Smogger. Smogger first. Silence. Push it. Oh, we're all silent, huh? Come on. Bring it. Finish him off. Oh, 
Get off him. He's got no arms now. We still got a job to do. <laughs> see you try to run. Yeah, you too. Alright, we're going down here. We can't bear it to heal us for a bit then. Train stations. Alright. Well, we're going this way. Heavy duty bracer. Right. Healing. I'm gonna move lightning and I just removed it, didn't I? Put lightning here, and then I put healing on Barrett here, which means he can heal more at once. Along with the magnify. See? He can use a bit more MP, but he'll heal more more of us at once. Hey goons. No surprises there. Seth from Street Fighter. Okay. Okay. I love that they've got like the goofy bandit design skill. Oh, they're starting to like each other. This is weird. Also, Barrett's due for a new gun. He's been holding on to this light machine gun for the longest time now. You guys again. Shit. Watch yourself. 
taken over. Here it comes, Rock You're done. Ready. Take him down. Say your prayer. Oh, wow. You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. That guy, that big guy got destroyed. <laughs> right, stop being chummy. We just saw a bunch of, bunch of our friends die. Alright, time to test this out. After you. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I'm not going out Come on. Like this. Worked up a good sweat. Now, can Barrett do it with here? Ho 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 ho, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Also, we're back here. Music isn't helping, by the way. More bad. No, these are people. Does it look like we can go this way? No. There's monsters everywhere. Jesus Christ. One piece. Who else well, made it out? I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the others. Hmm. This is. I don't even know where to start. We need able bodied men and women. Oh, Betty. I really hope that all my friends are okay. Oh, the cats are honey. Don't worry. Sector 7, huh? Yeah. Left a few things behind. You see? I know it's not much, but it's all I got. Big Bertha. I'm gonna sell you all my, all three of my grenades. Godspeed. Never know what you're gonna run into out there. Best be prepared. Careful out there. 
<sighs> Something tells me Sector 7 is not going to be pretty at all. Go. Rats. Back in the sewers again. That was rough. That was very rough. But Yes, the only way is to move forward and check out this new content, new story content. Um, don't know what to say. We, um, those three Avalanche guys died super hard. But hopefully, we get some closure on them. Six, seven, seven, six service tunnel, huh? I need to give Barry Big Bertha first. Okay. Let's see what's on the other side. Right. Finally, I can use some fresh air. Damn it! I still can't believe this happened. Oh. Definitely not safe. You can rest easy, folks. Listen, Sector 6 is right over there. We just need to walk a little bit longer, that's all. Still have that um, that sector five. Uh, that one was a lot closer. That sector five bit where we can get a bunch of like items out of that. Hello! Is there anyone out there that needs some help? Can't believe they let us back into sector seven. Tell you how relieved I am to see you. So, what now? Don't know. Find something, anything to do. Been back to the bar yet? No. No. Maybe you should go take a look. Maybe. <clears throat> Maybe. Let's. Okay. First the bar, then the rest. Careful. The roads are a mess. Watch your step or you'll wind up in a hole. Hello! Anybody out there? If you can hear me, say something! I take it that little Marlene safe and sound? That little girl's a hell of a lot stronger than you might think. I take it that little Marlene safe and sound. Anybody out there? Shout! 
Why are we not replying to this guy? Can you hear me? Anyone there? Barrett? Hey! Hey! Oh shit. We didn't even manage to go underneath the bar. Uh, like through the through the uh, through the little ping pong machine. Tifa. Ping pong? What, what's that thing called? Get back! I don't remember what that thing's called anymore. Shit! Oh, Barrett. Hear that? Wedge's cat. That's Wedge's cat. What? Let's follow. That's a, that's a high res cat. Ready? One, two, three. Ready? One. What the two, hell's happening? Three. <laughs> that was so weird. Okay. Ready? One. Two, three. At that angle, that camera angle doesn't work. Is this all that's left of Wedge's place? There's a crater down there. Oh no, is it gonna be Wedge? This place reeks of Shinra. Wedge? Wedge! Where is he? Oh. Jinra underground test site. Oh no, okay. Tifa! Cloud! Shout if you can hear me! Barrett section. If a search scope appears when you're in control of Barrett, that means there's a destructible uh, obstacle nearby. If there's no path, you gotta make it. Ooh, does Barrett have a setting animation? Sit down, Barrett. Take a seat. Bugaboo. You got it, asshole. Holy shit. Oh, we're done here. You really want to throw down with me? Check out this shit right here. Oh, yeah. Another one in the bag. Maximum Fury is really strong, and now I have it. Okay, first of all. You really want to throw down 
Oh my god. <sighs> Barrett really is not a time. Does the kick <gasps> two thousand gil? That paid off the uh, big Bertha. How long it take him to build all this beneath our feet? Not going down without a fight. Ooh, got a lot. Fuck on this. Hope you don't mind if I fill you full of holes. Oh, he survived. You ain't getting out of this. Check out this shit right here. Jesus Christ. Okay. Man, you'd think they dug halfway to hell. Suck it. See ya. Ain't got nothing on me. Cool. How convenient that thing just fell. And nothing happened. You're going down one way or another. Want some more? Stop on me! Jesus, Barrett. Out. Yeah, that's a boss behind there. That's a boss battle right there. I wonder what. Uh, I'm, I'm really wondering what end, like boss is gonna be. Suck on me! Hang on, this one first. See the little item over there. You really want to throw down with me? Want some more? Get your ass out of here! Oh, come on, I dodged it. I should use them all, right? You really want to throw down 
come with me! How'd you like that? Oh, we're done here! Just no escape in the mist there. Keep making our way up. Do you think that Barrett at this point in time thinks like both Cloud and Tifa are dead? You really wanna throw down with me? I'm really going to enjoy burning it all down. You know what? For the first time, Barrett, I'm agreeing with you. Tifa! Hey! Tifa! Barrett! You okay? Can you tell you the truth? Not really. I think there's enough somewhere. Can you take care of it? I got you! Come on! All of them bugs on fire. Crispy. Sorry. Hey. Bring it on. Where's Cloud? I don't know. Well, he can take care of himself. We've got babies. Do you like my new moves, Tifa? Hey, no thanks. Hope you don't mind if I fill you for the whole thing. <laughs> Are you all right? Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. All right. Gotta go find Wade. Come on. I love the way Barrett says wedge. Weege. Do I feel bad breaking all the bands? No. Does Barrett have anger issues? The answer to that is yes. I'm afraid to ask, but did you just shoot your way in here? Well, yeah. What else was I gonna do? that material as well. Open up. No. <laughs> Barrett's more fun to play than Cloud. Like, uh, his gameplay mechanics anyway. Another material. Warding. Oh. 
the wrong way. If I gotta climb another damn ladder. Super. Uh. Oh, it's a cutter. That's a cutter. God damn it. And they took my MP as well. That's fucking dog shit. Left plate first. What do you mean not so fast? Hey, eh. you think Wedge is holding up okay? Of course he is. He's a lot tougher than people think. Probably sleeping soundly dreaming about his gas. We should treat him to a nice meal with this guy. Oh yeah, another one in the bag. Okay. What? We are still kind of lost. Honestly, we're just going upwards. See ya. Check out this shit right here. <laughs> Look at all that, all, all those bugaboos. Hmm. Gotta stay on my toes if I'm gonna make it out of here alive. Sit your ass down. Wonderful. Man, when, when are we gonna beat up the cloud? Oh, it's which? Uh. 
<laughs> He's not alive. He's okay. You sure? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Making me worry like that. I'd kick your ass if you didn't look like shit. <laughs> Thank you. Wedge survives this? Okay, let's go. Let's go. But Cloud. Yep, it's you, all right. What is this? You get wedge to safety. I don't recall these now. What are these supposed to be? I don't recall these being a thing. Then again, this entire section is you, so. Gotta take out the range ones. There's your job. So cool. That's a big one. It's using its friends as weapons. I don't think they're friends.
What am I supposed to do as Tifa right now? What? Absorbed it? Hey, people, heads up! Just there. Check out this shit right here. This shit, asshole. Oh, in front. Got a whole heap of men with your name on it. So now. Check out this shit right here. Fuck on this. Wait, hey. Okay. Okay. Some sort of help. Summon, summon. Okay, Choco Flare. Nice one. I had to use me to be boosted. Can you fight? Come on!
That's bullshit. Oh my god. That was nonsensical. There was so many of them. <laughs> oh, please don't tell me to start like when I was like with a bunch of them. Because if it is, I'm going to cut it until I win. Because that would be ridiculous. Ridiculous with a capital R. Don't let it be there. Just let it be when the big guy shows up. I'll need to get the uh, assess material out of cloud. As well. Right. We're um We're gonna take five. Cause now we gotta like start all the way here. God damn it. God damn it. There we go. I just had to find out that it was winter ice. And then when you cloud, cloud. showing up at the last Here. second. Late to the party, and you giving me orders? Nice one, Cloud. Where were you the whole time? Oh yeah. Really? Not really the time to be happy. So how'd you manage to track us down? Followed the trail of bullet holes. There's nobody else I know who leave that kind of mess. <laughs> All right, let's uh Oh. After you. Okay. Oh God, were those people? Yeah, that's the Shinra I know. Is this where we're gonna find the head of Geno, like the, the headless Genova? Meant to be those like weird things you find a pot in Nibelheim. Where are we? Got thrown out? Where's Wedge? What the hell was that? We need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. Agreed. Let's go. <clears throat> well then. Pick up the cat. Cloud. Good job. Oh, I'm still Barrett. All right, time to give Cloud back his um. Wow, 18, and they're still not. They're still not using any.
Thanks for the thanks for the assess material, Clout. Really helpful. Oh, it's like Wolverine claws. All right, hang on. No, that's not it. No, that's not it either. What's steadfast block? Oh, hell yeah. I saw both Biggs and Jesse die. I saw them both at the pillar. Jesse and Biggs saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but. Don't. They've returned to the planet. Damn it. This also made me realize that Jesse's mom and dad are Sector 7 plate people. And they're probably but dead if too. They stop now, they'll never let us live it down. Let's get Wedge out of here. At least so one of them made it. We carry that weight. No matter how big <laughs> that weight is. Well, we're not actually going to return to uh, try to get Jesse or Biggs. I know they they're dead. Oh look, fucking Professor Audrey. Kyrie! <sighs> President Shinra. Scarlet. Professor Hojo, what a dickhead. He looks like someone, I just can't put my finger on it. Like, he looks like a guy that you, that I've seen before. Hey. I'm sorry, I truly am. We had no other place to go and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Aerith. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never going to let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat Enough! Team. But... Please, I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Oh, Barrett's a snorer, isn't he? Oh, that's a bad looking door. At least it's not in shot for too long. Huh. Very interesting.
see Marlene in there. Tifa's probably in there. There's a there's a chest in there that I really want. To a flower bit. Hmm. Hey. How is this? Is this a dream? Maybe. You tell me. You okay? Don't I look it? I used to live in the Shinra building, back when I was really little. Hmm. Your mom told us. Right. So it kind of feels like I've gone back to my childhood home, you know? No, Honestly, I don't. it's not that bad. So what? You want to stay? Come on, Cloud. Don't be silly. Your mom's really worried too. Hmm. Too? So you're worried about me? Uh, of course I am. Oh, Cloud. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Really. Is that... Everyone dies eventually. I suppose. So we need to make the most of the time we have. To live our lives the way we want to live. Every minute, every moment matters. I'll remember that. Good. So... You need to embrace this moment. Right? I'm glad I met you, Cloud. I really am. And then he wakes up. I'm grateful for all the words we've shared. For all the moments and the memories. You've made me more happy than you know. And I'll always cherish what you've given me. But... But whatever happens, you can't fall in love with me. Even if you think you have, it's not real. It's cause Zack was in love with her. That's why he feels this way about Aerith. Do I get a say in all this? It's almost morning. Time to go. I'm coming for you. If that's what you want, thank you. Right. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can, so please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I 
always knew it was coming. Knew that one day, I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. Hmm. Do what we can. Daddy! <gasps> Marlene. Are you going? Go, Cloud. Get out of here first. I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Hmm? <laughs> Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy... Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? <sighs> Can we go back and get that, that item now? And that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. <sighs> You'll come back, right? Bear is gigantic. Of course, I promise. <sighs> okay, you can go. <clears throat> Why do they insist on going Bear. close to the doorknobs? Oh yeah. She's tougher than me. Time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. Materia. So, how are we supposed to get topside? With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. So what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo? God damn it. Take care of my girl. I'll look after Marlene and Wedge. Don't worry. Cannot believe Wedge Good survives. Luck, you guys. I'll keep everyone safe. That, I think, is the biggest shocker. Mythical amulet. Uh, summon- strength of summons. Well, don't really need it. Every time a summon showed up, we've always won. Hey guys, it's funny because Wedge is fat, get it? Well, one of them had to survive, I guess. Maybe. No, they didn't have to, but I'm glad they did. Out of the way, Barrett. Stop walking in front of me. Stop it. Alright, we are going to rescue Aerith. But, first, there are things to do in Sector 5. Namely, 
I want to get, uh, I want to get a higher score in that stupid box smashing thing. Like a box, that was it. And we need to buy more stuff from Moggy. You think Barrett and Tifa are allowed in there? Because only Clown and Aerith want to trust the kids. That teacher that was secretly a honeybee, where is she? Hey Chadley, you got anything for me? My fellow grounders, listen up! Because boy do I have some news for you! Where? And it's assured to knock your socks all the way into next week! So after bombing reactors 1 and 5, what do the eco-terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako Reactor 7! Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage! The sky is falling and Avalanche is to blame! But wait! Did you know Wutai is the one funding their activities? What? For all their claims about fighting for the slums, they're nothing more than pawns of Wutai. Puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five gil. Five gil. Come on. Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wu Tai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want them, we got them. Does this mean there'll what? be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gil apiece. Cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit? <clears throat> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. Ease up, Barrett. Ease up. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for... Regrets or what ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you. Don't. Odd. Odd jobs, final jobs. These many people in the slums need desperate uh, need of assistance. Once the party enters the Shinra building, they'll, be, they'll no longer be able to help anyone in need. Therefore, try to help many people before entering Shinra HQ. I know we're short on time, but let's try to help out wherever we can. How I understand. far could they have gone? So, I think we're about to hit the end game. So, what what's gonna happen is that we are going to finish up on. Uh, hey. Good to see you, Kubo. These are expensive. Mughal Mora? Says sometimes. I'm taking that first. Okay. Alright, I need to get these two. And the, and the rest are not important. So... Let's get. Uh, I'm going to go play uh, Whack a Box a because day, Whack a Box gives you one for participation, and I think that's where we'll cut it because we will be back with uh, with five more skill points for each Barrett and Tifa. All right. See you next episode.